when I first walked in, it was very scary because I was, I think, realizing that this could be a huge life-changing event. I came in to confirm a pregnancy test that was from my house um, that was positive and I didn't want to go to the hospital for something like that. I just kind of wanted to make sure that I was doing the correct thing and that this was really happening. So I did come in and they confirmed that it was positive. It made me feel <laughs> a little scared, um, a lot scared, but I was in a very odd situation, not necessarily a good one. I was about to be evicted from my apartment in a few hours. So I was trying to either figure out how to back pay some of my rent or pack up all of my stuff, but I was also very nauseous, feeling very sick, which is how I found out that I was pregnant and decided to take the test. And I ended up coming in and I ended up being able to have a plethora of resources available to me. Um, there was a church that back paid a lot of my rent so that I was able to stay and not be evicted. And that was just an incredible feeling that somebody cared that much and that they cared that much and that I was not going to be homeless and pregnant. Um, my boyfriend and I had not been together for very long and so I called him at work and let him know that I was pregnant. And he was a little shocked as well, but we ended up getting it together and making some more phone calls and kind of just like, okay, well, where do we go from here? Um, so we, we came in for an ultrasound later, and I think it made it more real for Zach because it also made it more real for me. But I think his face was like the cutest thing ever. Like he saw it on the screen and was just like, "What?" Like it was so funny. But it was so cool to just like see that from him. I guess before it was all hypothetical, and then when you're actually in the room and you see the heartbeat, and then you kind of actually like feel it too. That connection for me kind of clicked. Um, and then, yeah, my face, I was just like, I was in awe. I was like, wow, this is something special. So, this is Emmett. He is a little <laughs> over nine months old now. But it feels like he's been with us forever. It's... Yeah. <laughs> so he definitely fits in with our family. And I don't know. He's he's an awesome kid to be able to parent, honestly. He's, he's a really good baby. And we've definitely stepped into our mom and dad roles. It's, it's been a little crazy and it's been hard. But we have been able to do it. And um, he's been working full time to be able to make sure that we have everything we need um, as far as like having our bills paid and all of that and I've been working part-time um, but that also gives me time to be able to be home with the baby and one of us is always home with Emmett so we don't have to pay for childcare, which has been really great um, but because of the financial stress I had at first and that we had moving in together it was nice to be able to take parenting classes at her choice because we were able to then earn money towards diapers and clothes and a lot of other things that we needed towards I mean babies need a lot of stuff like a lot of stuff and it's all huge it takes up so much space but I mean he's I'm, I'm glad he's taken over our house it's wonderful so. yeah we're just growing together you are absolutely uh, we just want to say thank you um, for impacting our lives um, in such a positive way um, and it means the world to us. I feel like thank you's not ever enough really, but I, I do also thank everybody that was able to help us and provide us with the knowledge and resources and everything to be able to be healthy and take care of him and grow together. And I feel like it's just, it's, it's been an incredible experience, but it was very scary and it didn't seem like it was gonna come out this way in, in the beginning, but it's, 
it's definitely, we can't imagine our lives any other way.